Good afternoon everyone, it's Roy here again at Alders Farm Fishery. I'm on Pines Lake on Peg 10 right at the top by the reeds up here. And I started off today fishing about 8 metres out and I've mixed up quite a bit of this nice little pellet mix here which has worked quite well. Didn't think I'd get many skimmers today because it's been a cold night and the water's very clear and the sun, it's glorious day. But I've actually got five decent bream in the net now, I caught them on maggots over that. Then I decided to go down the edge where I've been feeding a mixture of this and a mixture of that. And as you can see on the other clips from the videos how I've been feeding it by putting it into a pot. This is my deep rig, but down the edge rig, I've been using this DT float here, a 0.4 cone float, and it's set to about two and a half feet deep. And what I've been doing, I've got four number 10s down the line, a group of two there and a group of two there to let it drop through, a 16 wide gate pellet hook to 0.14 hook length. So I'm just sticking two maggots on the hook here. I have to look over my glasses because I can't see. And I've got mauve hydro in the pole there because the reeds are a bit thick there. Just move some of this ground weight. And I'm just putting in about a dozen or so maggots into my pot. Squeeze up a ball of ground bait and plonk that in the top there. Sits in there quite nicely. And I can just ship it out. And I'm fishing top two plus five sections here towards the end of the reeds. I did get a couple early in the era, but it's, it was difficult getting them there. But further down, it's away from me. It's a nice depth, but also the input to the lake's just up there. So where the water runs down the valley, it's got fresh water coming in here, which I think really makes this fishery so good because it's, it's, it's actually getting a flush through of water all the time. And it's not water coming off a farmer's slurry or anything else. It's nice, fresh spring fed, fed water. Makes the water very clear, especially in the winter time. But you drop your bait down there, and here we are, plonked in the water, and you know, the float's been going under, and Mr. Carp's been obliging quite nicely. I've got a couple about six pound, and some of you know three and four pound. So they're hard scrappers up here because they're nice, fit, and healthy. It's great fun on a nice spring day.